So Qasem Soleimani is the general in charge of uh, Iran's Al Quds Force, which is part of the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps, and he is perhaps the most important player inside the country as well as outside. Why? Because he controls essentially all of uh, the country's security forces, services internally as well as uh, externally. And his significance really is felt across the region because uh, he was the point man. He was the main strategist. He was the main architect of Iran's foreign policy uh, with neighboring countries, but also at the same time with all of the paramilitary proxies that Iran uh, supported from countries like Lebanon with Hezbollah, Syria, inside Iraq, for example, Yemen, uh, and elsewhere. And it gives you a sense really of how important he was that he traveled to most of these countries, if not all of them, uh, and met with them openly talking about their strategies, their policies, and telling them about what Iran expected from them in addition to giving them the military and, uh, and financial support that they needed. Some say that he single-handedly turned the tide in the civil war in Syria when the government of President Assad was coming under tremendous pressure. It was Soleimani with his uh, resources and forces that traveled to the country and helped the Syrian government government that was embattled uh, fight off some of the, the rebels that were trying to overthrow that government. So in some ways, he's attributed with saving the Syrian government in Damascus. He's also, though, uh, known uh, to have helped fight off ISIS in northern Iraq, fight off al-Qaeda elsewhere. And so you get a sense of just how much of a warrior he was from an Iranian perspective. Now, obviously, from an American perspective, it's a very different story. He was responsible for running all the paramilitary militias in Iraq that were responsible for killing hundreds of American soldiers, servicemen and women during the uh, Iraq invasion. But from an Iranian perspective, there perhaps is no other single figure uh, that sat at the nexus of both policy and strategy the same way that Qasem Soleimani did. Even the spiritual leader of Iran, Ayatollah Khamenei, is certainly the most important man because he is an ideological figure. He is a, no doubt about it, the most important spiritual figure in the country. But in terms of a person who sat on the nexus of both policy, security, strategy, as well as uh, military effectiveness, it was Qasem Soleimani. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.